To other matters, the senior advocate of Nigeria, Yakubo Chenoko Mekiao, has been sworn in as the 31st president of the Nigerian Bar Association. Olumide Apata, who had been leading the NBA over the past two years on Friday, handed over the reins of leadership to the 57-year-old senior lawyer who hails from Kebbi State, Northwest Nigeria. There is more in this report. In his handover speech, Olumide Akpata highlighted the role which the NBA continues to play in enhancing fairness and good governance in the country. He also called for the bar to rise up to the defense of the judiciary and sought his successor's commitments to further unite the bar and achieve better welfare amongst other concerns. We have to make sure, firstly, that you run an all-inclusive bar. The bar is made up of different components. We have the commercial lawyers, we have the litigators, we have the women folk. You must run an all-inclusive bar. Get them to buy in and then we can focus on that which we do for society. Continuity is a big issue in Nigeria and for a successor to commit to taking forward the, um, the, uh, the, the agenda of the previous administration is something that I think should be really applauded and encouraged. Yakubu Mekiao, a senior advocate of Nigeria, says his mandate will include furthering the respect for the rule of law in Nigeria for the good of the citizenry. What we experience in this country, it simply put the absence of the observance of the rule of law. Because where you find the observance of the rule of law, there you would find justice and all the challenges that we face in this nation uh, would not be our experience. So principally, that is what uh, is the, uh, the mandate of this administration, and that is what we are going to pursue. But here we are. You are isolating yourself. The world is going right. The legal practitioners in Nigeria are going left. Why, what are you hiding? Why are you not willing to submit your report to the Special Control Unit Against Money Laundering as created by the law, of course, the anti-money laundering you know, law that was passed and signed by the president in May 2022. Kebi State Governor Abubakar Bagudu, the EFCC Chairman Abdul Rashid Bawa, as well as senior members of the bar and bench were among dignitaries at the handover ceremony, which marks the end of the 2022 NBA Annual General Conference. Kemi Foladiemo, TVC News, Lagos.